<laughs> All right, I'm with my brother, man, from Decatur, where it's greater. How you doing, man? I'm good, man. I feel, I feel good. I got a lot of stuff going on this year. I mean, I mean, everybody's waiting on a new season of power, but Sundance, you got something coming right around the corner, right? Sundance, Saturday, uh, I'll be there Saturday. I got two films. So honored, man. So blessed. So we got um, my castmates are out here, actually. I haven't seen Megan yet, but A Boy, A Girl, in a Dream, produced by Datari Turner. Um, Kasim Basir, myself, Megan J. Ellis, so that'll be there, and then I got another film, Sorry to Bother You, uh, myself, Tessa Thompson, Makeith Stanfield, Danny Glover, Ami Hammer, so we had a we had a pretty good time, man. Tessa talked about that last night, she seemed pretty excited about that film. Special, bro. So Sundance will see me in a minute. So tell me, like, uh, your, your sister Ava, who put you in, I Will Follow way back, and I know you was doing stuff before that, but how surreal or how real has it been just to see her like rise up so fast and be doing these big movies a great question man I you know it's it's interesting when you uh, well it, it's befitting of it being Dr. King's birthday so I just say it to see it is to be it to believe it is to achieve it and ironically when I saw her the first time and I saw her with the camera and I saw her delegation which directing 90% is how you delegate and the DP of extraordinary ability um, that she uses, who's a great friend of ours, Bradford Young. I knew immediately because I saw it. So to see the conclusion, for me, I could see that, but it's an interesting thing to watch the process happening while everybody else chatters about what's happening. Because when I first was on I Will Follow, I said, oh, she's got it. You know when somebody's got it. You know, she comes from the world of marketing and publicity. She was a heavyweight over there, but in this world, it's very natural for her. It's like me with music. People are embracing me, and I'm so honored. You know, they haven't heard a lot yet, but they've embraced me enough to go, I'll give the guy somewhat of a listen. So some some people got it, they got it, and, and Ava DuVernay had it from day one. Wait, I got to ask you this. <laughs> what at? That Georgia game. Oh, man. My face just changed. The whole interview just shifted. I don't even, I don't even know why I brought that. I just thought. I mean, I, 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 mean, I guess the only thing that makes me feel... Somewhat better is what happened last night to uh, New Orleans Saints and Drew Brees. That was very similar. I mean, that was the NFL. I didn't play for that team. The other one was college. I played for that team. It sucked. It hurt real bad. Brother, we've been following you all year, man. Can't wait to see everything you got going on. 